I have an extreme personality and anytime I find something new that I like to do, I'm usually all in. Honestly, I've been like this my whole life. The problem was that when I was younger, I would kind of focus that energy on stuff that wasted time, mostly on like video games. If I think about all the time that I spent on video games and how stoked I would get about new games and how much research I would do on games and how much time I would spend trying to beat games or get really, really good at games competitively or just emerge myself completely in a game and discover every single nook and cranny that it has. I used to do that a ton. Sometimes I look back and think about how much time I wasted playing video games and it kind of makes me a little depressed. I actually have a video where I talk about that. And after wasting a bunch of time and applying my extreme personality to things that didn't bring me any value or any money or any positive change in my life and just kind of kept me in the same, you know, hamster wheel doing the same thing every day and and not getting anywhere and not improving my life, I finally started kind of putting that extreme personality towards things that brought me value. And by applying my extreme personality to a few good things in my life, I realized how much I could accomplish if I targeted that energy into things that would improve my life and help me do better and bring me value. My wife was pregnant and I had to figure out a career change and I did my CompTIA A plus certification and I got that one and I, I was applying my extreme personality the whole time. I was reading books, I was doing brain dumps, I was watching videos, I was determined to get these certs but then I got bored and I really didn't like them and I found programming and that's when I applied my extreme personality to learning how to code and I did that for 10 months straight and I mean I didn't play any video games for a while there. I took some time off of jujitsu just so I can focus on learning how to code and trying to get a job. I stopped working out. Some days I wouldn't even eat. I would wake up on my days off and I would open my laptop and I would code for 16 hours straight till I fell asleep with my laptop in my lap. And I'm, I'm not endorsing this as, as something that's healthy or how you should approach learning how to code. By any means, this is not normal people stuff. But some people out there do have extreme personalities like I do. And if you have an extreme personality and you're trying to like figure out how to get out of the rut that you're in, but you don't know what the next thing could be that does it for you, just try to start looking for those things that are positive and try not to focus that extreme personality on stuff that's not going to bring you value. Because once I did that, my life changed for the best. When I applied it to jujitsu, I got in really good shape. It was the first time that I followed through with stuff. I got competitive. When I applied it to learning how to code, I bettered my my life, I increased my salary, I started a career, I put myself in a position to provide for my family for the rest of my life as long as I can think and I can type, I can code, and I use it to better my life. And now I'm focusing that extreme personality on YouTube as you can see. I hit it really hard the first year, I got 100 videos out, I got to like 17,000 subscribers in my first year on YouTube which was huge, way more than I had anticipated to get to and now I've upgraded my equipment. I, I've gone all in. I rolled every penny that I made from the channel so far since I monetized it right back into it. I'm approaching YouTube with my extreme personality, just like I did with coding, just like I did with jujitsu. I'm going to keep focusing my extreme personality on it until the next thing that, that's going to bring me to the next level and put me in the next step of my life where I want to be that's going to bring me value. And when I find that next thing that's not YouTube and is something else, I'm going to apply my extreme personality and I'm going to better my life even more and I'm going to continue continue to do that. Put all that energy into something that's going to be good for you and you'd be amazed how quickly you'll start getting addicted to being successful and you'll start getting addicted to doing better and being better and improving your life and making more money and just living a better life all, all around because you know you're not withering away on a couch in front of a video game all day like I was. And I'm glad I don't do that anymore. If you have an extreme personality and you've applied it to areas of your life for the better, let me know in the comments because I'm really interested in hearing how people use their personality traits to better their lives. And thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.